What is going on, people? We're back here today on Showdown because I'm just back into the groove now. I've been playing this DLC every day. I've been having a blast, honestly. Uh, the last DLC was pretty good, too, in the beginning. But then towards the middle of the metagame, it started to get stale with all that teleport clefable stuff. But right now, the new DLC has just come out. There's a bunch of hype, and I've been having a blast using all these fun techs. I got this team from my buddy, Ultimate Player 9000. I said I need a Scyther team because everybody was like, when's he going to use Scyther? When's he going to use Scyther? And I was like... Why would I use Scyther? I haven't used a Scyther like before in my life, you know? Like I barely knew this thing existed. I didn't even know like this thing did exist. Anyway, it's got this new move, Dual Wing Beat. If you guys didn't know, it's the two hit flying type move with technician backed behind it. Each move becomes 60 base power, so it's effectively 120 base power, which is pretty cool. Scyther's stats are definitely trash, uh, but the speed is like okay and the attack is like okay. But God, I know this thing is going to be disappointing. Um, but you know what? You gotta have a, a positive outlook, and we're using it anyway. Because look at the rest of the team. We got top agent zone, Mandibuzz, who is never you never leave with never leave home without it. Primarina, which I hate, but I know Subcom Mind is actually pretty decent. Specs I know is bad, but Subcom Mind definitely has a uh, has some pretty good uh, utility. Rashifu, whose sprite is unfortunately not there yet. The scarfed one though, and then Hippo. You know, Hippo is very effective in the current meta. My favorite part about the new meta, guys, is that Zero Aura, get him out of here. That thing is garbage now. We got Tangorth back. We got Amoongus back. Like, it, it's just not looking good. I'm telling you, it's not looking good for that thing's future. I don't see Zero Aura. Um, I don't see uh, Zero Aura being around. Anyway, first game back, we got this guy with his star with Urshifu. Very nice, very nice. I'm going to smack this guy, and then I'm going to tell you all to like the video after I beat him, and then subscribe. But I'll just tell you right now, too. Thank you for subscribing yesterday when I said to subscribe. I'm trying to hit 100k, so go do that. Anyway, looking at this matchup, I wish Scyther got access to, like, Earthquake or something. Uh, you know what's interesting? Magnezone's actually pretty crazy good here, I'd say. I'd say it's actually really good here. Primarina definitely be putting in some work, too. Unfortunately, Urshifu isn't banded, um, but... You know, it's fine. We can handle it. I'm going to start the timer, though. See where we go. I wonder if he's looking up what my team is. Bro, you can't find this team on the net, bro. You can't find this team on the net, bro. I think I know who this is. I think this is uh, Brand Flakes. The avatar, the name. Is this Brand Flakes? Let me find. I don't. I feel like it might be. But maybe it's not. I don't know if any of you know who that is. He's an old player. If we just use his like shit like this. I don't know. That was a, that was a player on the ladder though. Showdown ladder players will know who this guy is if you've been playing uh in the last like if you played in like Oras, you know exactly who this is. This guy used to use like the most annoying um fat teams. Very like innovative player though. Very like creative type uh creative type stuff. But very fat. Very often had uh, this type of shit. Goes into Urshifu here. Um, I'm not trying to get CC'd, you know. So I should get 2 KO'd. Dude, Urshifu's not even in the calc. Are you dead ass? What's this? So what do I make it? Do I make it like a Crawdon? I guess. Give it 130 attack too. And then I gotta make it jolly. Cause he's definitely jolly. Choice band. What move is he going for? Close combat, right? And then I gotta make this thing a fighting type too. Fighting type. And then we're going against Hippo with the full fizz death. The whole fizz death. 368, 420. So this is like truly, fully physically defensive. So close combat does 60 to. Oh, with adaptability. Holy shit. It does 45 to 53. Um. Wow, that sounds fucking bad. He U-turns out and takes damage instead. How, was that U-turn banded? It has to be, right? If U-turn... Yeah, so he is banded. Um, he goes for U-turn there. He's banded. I, I let him take a little bit of chip, though, so I feel like I can't be too unhappy with how this went, right? So, uh, I'm not I'm not really pressed about this. Um, yeah, it's fine. My Scyther has the potential. Truly, he does have the potential if we get rid of some of these guys. You know, some of these guys need to get. I need to get my rocks up. That's going to be the real issue here, getting up my rocks. Because he doesn't even have removal. Unless it's like Defog, Talon Flame, or something like that. I just U turn on myself here. Um, I feel like the risk of a. I feel like if he stays in, it's going to be to like stun spore me, which would be terrible. But yeah. 
um he won't sleep powder he probably he sludge bombed me interesting uh i'm gonna vote switch here though man this shit is annoying fat manda buzz eating up all the hits he probably just wanted to poison me which makes sense honestly um but i need to get my opportunity to uh to rocks up like i need it the rock if rocks don't go up i'm so screwed this game it's gonna be the only way i can uh, limit his regenerator core and all that stuff it sucks that the first game is a stall game and he's taking oh like a like a disgusting amount of time it's a five minute five and a half minutes in and we had we've only done five turns what is this anyway he clicks after a minute um i'm gonna go hippo here and just get my rocks up i really like those up uh, him putting up rocks is whatever i need to knock off this stupid chance he's uh whatever all right so we trade there which is interesting um i'm gonna go to shifu here is he soft boils yeah so tangrowth is for sure coming in here <clears throat> which means i'll just u-turn as he does go into tangrowth yeah i did that so i could start the vote turn nonsense you know i just need to start the vote turn core up limit the chance the best way i could you know um so yeah the only problem is urshifu is definitely getting chipped by everything uh which is something i do got to think about um okay i'm just gonna go and you turn again because i honestly don't care about taking damage with this i feel like i don't care about taking damage with this from the uh yep but so he does this which is great tebow i don't think is a two hit ko so i have to vote but uh this worked out good for me he goes into tangrowth which gets slapped up going to my site there here brother we got the whole we got sticks we got everybody the whole team is here site there is here go to talent flame stupid rocks on the talent flame makes it lift everything very annoying either way magnazone is getting getting everything he wants this man is getting messed up magnazone is here let's go i want to t-bolt really badly but i don't know if it'll two a ko the chancy i'm gonna t-bolt anyway hopefully it'll two a ko it won't though if vol switch did seven if vol switch did 19 and that's 70 and this is 90 90 is about like it's like 29 percent something like that as stronger so it won't it might it might because no it, it won't it won't it won't it won't i think i need two very decent rolls on a 51 percent chancy i think i need two very decent rolls on a 51 percent chancy he goes back in a tang to continue taking abuse continue continue this let's go let's go keep going to this thing go keep going to that thing since y'all want to just i just want to switch around forever right you think this is pokemon switching wrong wrong that's what they want you to think he should go into magirna here finally he's probably happy i ghosted him uh i'll go mag here and just vote out again i mean wait he's probably can't even kill me he's definitely like that vote switch pain split trash i know for sure that's what he is or he's probably like heart swap or whatever yeah i go to this which doesn't end up helping me um damn he goes to tango right there okay probably just wanted to get some leftovers back i'm gonna go to urshifu because i don't think he's gonna go i think he's gonna go chancy here i think he's gonna go chancy here let's see he's gonna go chancy he's gonna knock off he went for focus blast and missed which is hilarious dude tried to catch my urshifu and missed the shit ha ha that sucks dude <laughs> dude tried to snipe my shit but he totally fucking airballed that's tough that's really tough honestly i feel bad kind of but like it's fake not really but not really anyway we'll take that for sure um any anything we can to get you know get away from these big threats anything we can do to get get, get away from these big threats oh shit my dog going crazy oh shit my dog going crazy Hey, yo, my bad, man, my bad, man. You know me, you be getting excited, you know, you get excited. The dog, dog's in here, you know, seeing me play Pokemon. You know, when you see these many, this many reads, your dog be like, what the fuck, how he do that? So I think that's just like what happened, probably. If I had to like pinpoint it to something. Wicked Blow will kill here, so I can just Wicked Blow this guy with uh, Urshifu, and then we'll see. I think I win. 
perks will eat. Unfortunately, I'm Scarf instead of Bandit. Bandit would have been way superior. This kind of sucks, but whatever, it's fine. Um, I'm just going to switch back into zone. I thought about you turning there. I know it was like the better play, but I'm soft. Is he going to scald and burn me? I mean, my Primarina is going to win anyway. He goes to Urshifu there. Okay, cool play. Cool play, Chief. Cool play, Chief. Finally, a play from this guy to get some offensive momentum, which I think was much necessary. I go into Hippo because that is my boy. As he goes for Wicked Blow, which does so much damage. <laughs> uh, why is this dog shit so strong? I think Mandibuzz actually gets 2 it KO'd by this, which is hilarious. Or Shifu probably gets like smoked as well. You think or Shifu, or Shifu lives? Probably, yeah. It, it lived that pretty easily, actually. Um, but yeah, it's pretty obvious here he's gonna try to go into his Tangrowth. So, yeah, easy read. Um, the Volt is a free kill now, which is good. Volt or do I T Bolt? Volt or do I T Bolt? Does T Bolt kill Chansey at 22? Yeah, it does. It does. Wait, I just win by staying in here and T Bolting. Everybody dies. This is a GG. If I just T Bolt, it's just a GG. I don't want him to go into potential magirna on volt switch get a pain split opportunity i don't want any uh, i don't want any possibility of that yup don't yeah see i don't want magirna living see this is how you dissect a stall team bro this is how you dissect a stall team do you see the site they're putting in the work he didn't even have to click the wing beat because at the end of the day at the end of the day there's always one agent who just it just brings tears to my eyes the amount of work he can put in and his name his name is agent magnus oh look at this yo give this video a like a thumbs up so that they're the same thing subscribe Use my referral code for the Brave Browser if you'd like to support me for free. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I had to, uh, you know. It's just such a beautiful, it's just such a beautiful game, you know. When you play such a beautiful game sometimes, you know, you just start feeling different, guys, you know. It just, it, every battler has this feeling. You know, when they play such an amazing game, you just don't know what to say. This was that game, you know. He had, he had the stall, the tools over and over. But at the end of the day, at the end of the day, all he had was his stall. Me? I was prepared. I knew. I knew his team was coming. I knew this stall was... I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I'm saying I predicted his stall. I predicted this to be the first game. But every time I get stall as the first battle in a live, I always just smoke it. I feel like I always just smoke it. Um, this Magnus one has taken a ton of damage from rocks. I just vote to kill. Wait, wait, no, I don't. I don't want Tang to live. Let me T-Bolt. Yeah, I don't want to vote. I, I win the sack game. I win the sack game. There's no way he can uh he can win. This guy has taken quite a bit of time, bro. He, but I can't uh, complain. This team's good, though. I got to name it. Sight there. At least zone is good. This thing, to the end of time, is able to be. See, they were like, it doesn't have hidden power. What are we going to do? Does it need hidden power? Does it need hidden power? No, man. Chansey is not accounted to this thing. Anyway, we continue to wait. I'm going to get another game because he's just time stalling now because he lost, which is pretty frustrating. Whatever. Next game. Goes into Tangro, sacks it. Okay, cool. Yeah, Tebow was quite free. No point not to really go for it, you know. I have a free second, man, to buzz. It's utility is completely out the door at this point. If I remove rocks, it's way worse for me. Um, plus, he'll never not be able to get up rocks because Chansey rocks up on every single Pokemon. Primarina already ends this game because Rishifu has uh, one more switching if it comes in this turn because Sands up. So, and there's no other mod he can go to, right? Because the other three just lose. Talonflame doesn't run fire moves. They run will -O I got this guy with Scent Scorch, so I already lost. Um, Scent Scorch is the best Volker on a counter. Okay, so he's got nothing but threats on his team. Bro, Mega Spongebob. Let me see this guy's ranking. I want to know if it's that guy. Brand Flakes. 1865 and resets win-loss after every game. That's interesting. <laughs> That's interesting. Um, okay, whatever. Uh, I mean, he could win now that Chance he's recovered. I didn't know the defog potential was there. That's pretty interesting. Um, but I'm pretty sure I still take this with Scyther. Because even if you remove rocks 
and put them back up here and status my site there if i knock off you're screwed as he is what no item or what this is just no item right that's what this means right this is fine unless it's t spikes knocks off my specs which is fine that's fine just gonna sd here yeah this is fine as it goes for rocks but great play time to lose um this is better to a ko this is better to a ko come on oh yes sir oh my god sight there sight there what are you doing bro like this motherfucking video are you crazy yo that was i'm like i don't even know what to say bro i'm lit right now i'm lit bro sight there pieced them up gone gone get out of here get out of here get out of here get out of here lose lose leave mega spongebob lose lose sight there did what it came to do it's gonna sweep you bro he really went for stealth rock like i didn't have that brave bird sight there tech come on bro come on bro get this shit out of here come on bro he really went for stealth rock against sight there you gotta be kidding me you know some people they just they just be they just be clicking buttons you know that's that's all you can say he goes for hydro pump that man is specs oh lord <laughs> that man is offensive <laughs> I was expecting a flip turn. I got hit with that hydro pump. Goes into center scorch here on my vote switch. Takes a lot. GG, you bum. And I'll knock off here just to let you know that I don't give a fuck. GG. That's GG. Okay. I really enjoyed this game. Truly, truly. Because it showed the power of Scyther. The power of Scyther. A beautiful mod. Never let anyone tell you that mod isn't beautiful it is it's like one of the best mons ever i've decided after using it today for the first time so i'm gonna get my rocks up here All right this is a calculated play because there is a noivern and you know it's kind of scaring me primarina hasn't come out yet i realized last game it didn't come out um but i'm hopeful for it he goes for will wisp there not a bad play i'm gonna go primarina here i like it as a check to uh the possible Noivern and Vaporeon that could come in. If this guy's a Willow West plus Power Whip, I just destroy my computer. But I have a feeling he's probably either rest on this or I don't know. But I feel like if I'm in his position, I'm likely to just click the fire lash as he wisps me again, which is horrible. So he predicts me very well there. And I get smashed as a result. This is awful because Primarina was great here. And I really didn't think he'd wisp again. Because I could have whirlwinded very well there. But I guess it didn't matter. I go to this as he's fucking power whip plus wisp. Okay, well then why didn't you just whip my hippo and whip this too? I don't understand. Now I'm like actually confused. Because I feel like he didn't have to make these plays. Wait, let me scald here. I don't know if I'm blast kills. I don't understand actually like i actually don't understand now because i i feel like he could have just killed me if he had power whip either way he gets out of there pretty good i mean hippo is burned and primarina's dead no everyone's boots anyway what the hell 70 okay whatever uh, <laughs> i like mad confused i'm like what is this i go into mandibus who is weak to the electric but bro he's 70 base attack so like should i be afraid I don't think so. I'm hopeful that Scyther... Um, the problem with Scyther is that you can't really Violet anymore. So, it's kind of tough. Okay, I'm going to U-turn out of here. Bring in Scyther. Go for dual wing beat. He goes for Dragon Claw. Ooh, interesting. I'm just going to go for dual wing beat. I don't see a resist, so I don't see a reason not to click it. SDing won't make sense. SDing won't make sense from, from my perspective. Because he has a, his Scarfer is probably a. It's probably a. Guard of War, right? So. He, that's there. Noivern's faster. Why are people using regular Sand Slash? 
I need to use uh, Expanding Force in DD. That one's coming up. I need to use Anger Point uh, Crocodile to counter team all these annoying, annoying uh, Urshifus. You know, I need that. I need that. Okay, he's taking forever. That is slow today. What was I going to say? This is my second game today. Damn, slow games. He goes to this guy, just dies, which we'll take for sure. Just kill that. Um, I U-turned out because I was afraid of uh, something. So, yeah, that's why I did that. Anyway, <laughs> I was afraid of something. I just didn't want to miss. Uh, but Scyther is... Uh, what, what, what was I saying? Right, Heavy duty boots. Sucks because you can't really violate or band. But it's fine. Or Shifu comes back in. I mean, Kamo comes back in. And this mod's crazy, too. I can't wait for its sprite. This Kung Fu Panda thing to come back. I'm really liking its, uh, its place in the metagame. Very strong. Very strong. But yeah. Let's see. Let's see. What are we thinking here? So I think I'm just going to go into my uh, site there again. Is he DDs? Oh, shit. I didn't think he'd be DD. He looks like he's defensive dance or some shit. I live this, though. Yeah, Scyther's actually pretty decently bulky. Kamoa gets two-pieced by that wing attack. It doesn't matter. Or that wing beat. Easy. Easy. Very nicely done. Very nicely done. In comes Gardevoir with the scarf. I don't need this anymore. Yeah, you can have it. I knew he was Scarf, but um, this is a sweep waiting to happen. So, yeah. Yeah, this this auto-crit garbage is so funny, dude. I love it. I'm going to sack uh, Magnus one at this point because it's at 10% or whatever. It's good to sack to the physical Neuven. This man about to click Brave Bird. Honestly, he about to do it. This man about to Brave Bird. He think he a whole bird. Okay, so he goes for Hurricane. And that's it. Let's just get out of this game, bro. Let's just end this game, please. Next game. I need a fast-paced game. Maybe it's mine or not. I don't know. I need a fast-paced game, though. I need a one-second game. He goes into this. I'm literally just going to slack off. So he takes a little sand chip, you know. Next game. Let's go. Add game. How high am I on the ladder? I'm probably like 1650, 1750 in that range. Where am I? 1784. Okay, yeah. So, like that range. Uh, okay, we got this guy with HO. Looks very, very, very strong. That is why you run HO. So, you can run the strongest, the strongest mans over and over. He has Magirna, so you need to understand that the person we're playing. The morals, we don't know. We don't know. We just don't know. He kills me here, which is fine. Um, I'll go into. I wonder if I played this right. Hope so. I probably did. Okay. I feel like Noivern lives this, right? Okay. Anyway, he has his Mew HO or whatever this is. I'm just gonna lead off with this in SD. I hope he doesn't have Will O Wisp. Okay, don't hax me. Don't confuse me. Haha. <laughs> As long as he doesn't have like Will O Wisp, I should be good to not like auto lose here. Yeah, so he spikes up. I'm just gonna U turn out, kill his ass, get out of there. Great. So we get that thing out the way. He gets up a spike, which isn't the end of the world. I mean, it hits everybody decently. Um, GG. So it hits everybody decently, but yeah, gotta be smart. If I go zone, it baits in the Halucha. I like going to zone because it, it baits in the Halucha. I don't want Magirna coming in. The problem with Magirna is it's another Mon that punishes honest Pokemon like Mandibus <sighs> who defog. That's a problem, man, with HO. They'd be running all these Mons that are supposed to hurt Mandibus. It's like, why would you even want to hurt Mandibus? Like, stop being stupid. See, now look at you dragon dancing up like my name isn't Magnazone, bro. Like, what are you doing, bro? Like, you know who I am, bro. I feel like you do know exactly who I am. And then you fire blast on the switch. The audacity. The audacity to click that shit. Come on. It's okay, though. It's okay. He's probably going to go into Azumarill or Mag. Mag, right? Yeah. This looks very tough. 
Mag will probably just kill my guys here. Goes for Ice Beam. This is scary though, because, yeah. He goes for Shift Gear. He's definitely Focus Blast too. So, like, I don't know if I can even win this. I don't know if I can even win this. This set just sweeps, dude. I forgot about the Menace. I forgot about, like, hell. This thing is AIDS. I lost. I lost. It's over, I think. Like, I just can't win. It just sweeps the rest of the team. It just needed one turn. And it got a turn on every Mon, because nothing can KO, except for... No, nothing can KO. So it could have shift geared at any point and ended this. Okay, so I found the first weakness of my team. My DLC undefeated run has gone down. Unfortunately, bro. GG. I told you. I told you, man. I told you what Magirna was going to do to me. Unfortunately, bro, our run is finished. The undefeated run. But I learned something. I hate Magirna. But it's fun. We'll move on to the next game. Hopefully, we do not run into Magirna again. It was just that Focus Blast set. I knew if it had Focus Blast, I was going to lose. Because, like, this team can't switch into Ice Beam Focus Blast uh, coverage. Because the last move would have killed Primarina regardless. We got this guy with his Chansey Alakazam. What is this? I might look this up on the forums. I feel like I've seen this team before. I saw their sample teams, and they were using Nasty Plot Alakazam in the, in the sample. But I feel like it's bad. Nasty Plot Alakazam does not seem promising. Um, it doesn't seem promising to me. Like, it's just, it's it's not, I don't know, maybe not bad, but it's not that good. Maybe because I spam Mandibus, so, like, obviously I'm probably biased. Anyways, Hippo's the lead. Leads off with Tang. This dude's always lead Tang. This is going to be, like, the first game where I just wreck with, uh, Specs zone, hopefully. This time he actually has some like n offensive dudes, so yeah. Gonna end the U turn here. As he goes to Magirna. I'm gonna go to Magna Zone and just vote switch out into Hippo. I'm thinking this is the same thing as the other one, right? The uh, what's it called? Just the uh, defensive one, right? I mean, the problem is, though, I don't know if Hippo can take it. It's full spadef. Whatever, I knew he'd vote switch, though. Got your ass. Gonna get this rocks up. I knew he'd, uh... Because it's funny, man. They all use the same, uh... The same sets from Gen 7. Which are still probably effective, but... Mm. Alright, so Tangrowth is gonna come in here. So now is where we start the... You guys remember? You guys remember what the, what I'm talking about? Where we start literally what, what just happened last game. It's, it's about to happen again. Literally, the exact thing is the first game is going to happen now this is pathetic but this is how it goes these kids they use style and they're like ground types i haven't heard about those why oh you gotta be shitting me it's mixed with synthesis i'm screwed i'm screwed i'm screwed this is terrible <laughs> this is terrible what kind of asshole runs mixed synthesis? Next time I'm flash cannoning that ass. Goes for flash cannon there. Super scrub play. Pain splits coming here. But ain't, it is not a thing I can do. Alright, well I guess we killed it though. So, I don't know. It's not terrible. I mean, mag's not a threat. But I feel like this wasn't a good trade for me. I feel like I actually wanted the HP on this. This was actually not a good trade for me. Goes to Cinderace here. Well, that's fine. That thing sucks. It's not Rillaboom. It doesn't suck, but it's not Rillaboom, which is pretty bad. So, he U turns out, takes damage. That's my favorite. The damage for no reason. I go into Mandibuzz here as it goes for plot. I should have gone into Urshifu on Focus Blast, but I'm pussy. Fuck. Why did I do that? I thought he'd be Focus Blast. That's really bad. I needed him. I really needed him in my life. That was really bad. That was really bad. I think I botched this one up. I really thought it was going to be Focus Blast, but of course it's Dazzling Gleam after running Nasty Plot. What else would it be, right? So I lose one of my biggest uh, threats, which is really bad, but whatever. Just going to keep on U-turning and keeping up this stupid pressure. Feel me? This intense pressure must persist. Okay, I botched the intense pressure. Because I get lazy. Let me go Magnus on here. On Tangrowth, yeah. Let me flash Kenny here again. 
kill the Tang growth. I knew he'd get greedy for no reason. So he sacks his Tang. Um, I don't know, man. I've played this pretty badly. So I don't know if he's going to be able to end this for me. But we'll see. Powerball misses, which is cool. Goes to Pex. Gets pieced by my Earthquake. Goes into Chansey. Takes a little extra there. Oh, what? Soft modes again. Gets Whirlwind into Zam. Might as well just chip. It goes back into Chansey. Is that just Whirlwind out again? Cinderace comes in. They're all heavy duty boots or whatever. Are they all like boots or whatever? Like, what is this crap? Um, just gonna earthquake here. Is it toxic? It must be, right? Like, what is this? Why is it slow? Or is my hippo just fast? Soft boats there. Okay. I just U turn here. He stays in for no reason. That shouldn't even make sense. All he did was lose soft world on his chancy, but we'll take it either way. Um, yeah. Just gonna whirlwind that ass out. Pick the Alakazam out. Chancy comes in to take more damage and get whirlwinded out again into Cinder Ace, which will just get whirlwinded out again, dude. Your chancy is gonna continuously get whirlwinded. And all this stuff. You will run out of your soft boards because you want to be greedy. You you think soft boards are forever. They're not. They're not forever, stupid. They lose. They disappear. Fuck. I'm so bad. I'm going to Primarina here. So I can calm mine and lose to this. I totally choked. He teleports out. Why? Why did you not just Okay? A poison move okay he haze you better be haze better be haze <laughs> better be haze uh, i'm going for scald here okay so it's teleport chancy which is why it couldn't do anything besides just sit there great uh, i hope this is enough to win it's probably not i feel like i needed to Somehow get past chance. This is not haze. It's but I think Chansey still defeats me quite easily. Um, coming again. All right, let me just spam Scald a few times. Do a little bit of damage, you know. Try to get a little hacks. All right, burn him. Get that shit out of there. Kill that with Moonblast now. Excellent, excellent. He goes into Pex for no reason, unless it's haze. Um, but. I feel like I'm just going to sub. He goes into Cinder Ace. I thought about attacking again, but I don't understand what this play did for him. U-turn won't kill me. He Pyro Balls, which breaks my sub, but Zam can't kill me either. Oh, it's Psyshock? Okay. I lost. Damn. Did I? No, I win. Hippo sweeps. LMAO. You can't KO me unless you have Grass Nut, in which case I'll smash the computer. I'll smash it right here right now. He could win either way. I think if Earthquake doesn't kill, I just lose. Nasty Ply just wins and I lose. Yeah, if Earthquake doesn't kill. And I don't think it kills. I think I lost. Fuck. No, dude. After all that, I'm going to lose because Alakazam doesn't die to my hit. Sacks the Chansey. Okay. And comes Pex to do whatever it's supposed to do. This is a bad play by him. Going into Pex. Do I go to Magnezone? Or do I go Mandibuzz? Is this like a double situation? You know? Do I like double? I think plus two life orb Dazzling and Gleam cleans this. Or like what? I feel like Mandibuzz is a fine play. I don't really understand it. He does double. Okay, so I'm assuming then foul play kills. Doesn't kill or something. Okay, so he just does that. So maybe I see I thought about earthquaking, but I didn't understand the double there. I didn't understand why he couldn't just because even if I roosted, I mean maybe it was to take the extra six percent so plus two gleam could kill me. If it was that, then that makes sense. But that's the only thing that makes sense to me. I don't understand why he didn't just uh take his nasty plot and try to sweep there. Maybe he wanted the extra six percent. I can appreciate that play then. This is taking too long. 57 turns. This has been a long live. Like, battle-wise, it's felt long. But these have been some fun games. It just sucks that I sacked the site there. 
when it was looking to uh it was looking to impress and i said no dude we don't need you but i needed him bro that was pretty bad let's see in comes pex to take an earthquake i don't understand i don't understand maybe he wanted the sand gone but i don't understand i don't see how yeah i don't see how he can lose dazzling gleam will kill Oh my You beautiful beast You beautiful beast Good job Hope y'all enjoyed The team was fire Scyther's fire Shout out to my boy Ultimate Player 9000 Like I said If you guys want to support me for free You can download my referral link To the Brave browser It's a completely private browser And you get paid to use it And I'll get paid if you use my referral link It's completely free So if you want to use it To support me for free Go ahead If you don't want to use it Don't worry about it But the code below is Brave.com Slash uh, I think it's like BLU441, but it's something like that. Either way, see you guys soon. Peace.